it's Shea Bear 1000 here. We got Monkey over here. Hey. And we're going to do a review, but we're going to do it a little different. And what we're going to do a review on, you've probably seen it in the thumbnail. So we'll get to that when we get out here and I'll explain more to you. So let's get to hiking. Okay guys, so we are at Potts Preserve again, and they're having a hunt today, but they're supposedly over that direction. We're not going to be going in that direction, but Monkey's got, turn around Monk. <laughs> we met a fellow YouTuber, I think it's, what's, what's his channel name, Hike With Me? Yeah, I think so. And uh, he gave us that orange thing, so we don't get shot. <laughs> But uh, he just said he had it on his hat, so he was back here hiking. Uh, link, huh? link it will to his channel will be in the description below. So what was you gonna say? Uh, I was gonna say that he went on the trail and got scared on it because he was going that way where the hunters were. Yeah, he was heading yeah. that way. We're gonna be. We're going. We're just kind of following the water, so right. we should be all right. They can't stop us from coming out here. I just don't like to mess up anybody's hunt, you know. But they're squirrel hunting, and it's awful windy today, so they're probably not going to be doing very good. <clears throat> but we brought a picnic lunch. Like I said, we're going to be reviewing those um, those hot funyuns. I've never seen them before. I don't know how many other people has had them, so I don't know if they're any good or not. We're going to find that out together, and we'll let you know. But we got a couple miles to go yet. We got Bruno with us, so we're going to head back in here. And where are we going, Mama? We're going to the cabin. I'm going to take Mama to the cabin because she's never been there yet. So I think she'll like it. And that's... I fried up some bologna and cheese for sandwiches we're gonna have a little picnic back in here it's gonna be great guys so stick around for some more fun all right so we're heading back to the cabin now got a couple mile walk I'll kick you on if we see anything interesting and we'll go from there so sorry about the wind I didn't bring a mic because I knew we was gonna be doing a lot of hiking so less stuff to carry right now so anyway, we're almost halfway to, we gotta go to the campsites. And then after that, we got another little ways to go yet. So we're about halfway to the campsite area now. And then we'll hit another trail that'll take us to the cabin. Well, we'll hit another trail that takes us to another trail that takes us to the cabin. So stick around guys, more to come. Okay guys, so we're on the, we went through the campgrounds. We didn't film that because you guys have already seen the road. Now we're on the trail to the cabin. And uh, Monkey and Bruno's behind me. I'm walking point. So I'll show you where we came out the last time I was here. We came out right here. And we walk that way. That's the campground. So we're going to go to the right. And we're going to follow this road. <coughs> Excuse me. And then we're going to... Because when I went in last time, I followed the river. That was a mistake. When you get back over in there, it looks like this. So... And then I ended up coming out on this road anyway. So... I'm walking point and uh i'll probably kick you on i'll kick you back on when we get to the uh to the intersection and then once we get there we're not far from the from the uh cabin which you guys have already seen but monkey hasn't seen it so she, her main her main thing is to film that and my main thing i will I will have some footage of the cabin for you for those of you that may have missed it or for my new viewers I'll show you the cabin 
but uh we're about halfway there right now so we still got a ways to go yet and when we, and then we got a ways to go until we get to the to the intersection then we will when we get to the intersection we'll be about three quarters of the way there and then it's pretty easy walking from there so i'll kick you back on when we get to the intersection give you an update we'll stop and rest there for a minute uh, she's got a bag that's got our drinks in it and our sandwiches and she's also carrying bruno but she's got her camera on her head so she's filming for you guys too so don't forget to check her out so all right i'll see you at the intersection okay guys we're at the intersection we're gonna be going that way but the last time when we went out we went that way because it said trailhead and then river to lake trail is up there it's this way um so i think monkey's turning her camera on but we're going to be going that way that's what i just i dubbed it the intersection because there's like five different ways you can go now one of these trails if you follow a couple more miles up there's another uh camping place where you, you can't get to it with car you have to hike to it this is where i showed you guys that so we're gonna be heading this way but like i said last time we went out that way and it was a long way so we'll be going back out this way where we came and see i don't know why they painted this over a river loop they painted that over for some reason but as you can see we're heading this way we're about three fourths there monkey's getting excited so <laughs> she's got to put that orange thing on her so she don't get shot at i can't remember But see, this is why this this is why I call it the intersection. So, anyway, so we're gonna go cool. down here. All right, let's head to the cabin. Okay, guys, we're getting really close now. <coughs> Monkey don't know because she hasn't been here yet. So I told her to turn her camera on. And right over here's the river. So, we're really, really close. I think right up around this turn here. So, like I said, I'm walking point for her because she ran into a cobweb. <laughs> I hate spiders more than she does, but that's okay. I'm an outdoors guy. So, anyway, like I said, I didn't film a lot of this because the main thing that I'm going to do is a review. But she's filming a lot of this because she's here for the cabin. And I'm sure she'll try some of them too. Yeah, okay, like, guys, so. It was an orange though, right? Yeah, citrus. So, this is for the guys. For those of you guys and gals that have not seen this spend the night we're going to dock the boat right there and right up over here, right here. do a ghost investigation here yeah, nice alright on to the review ok guys so this is what we're going to be reviewing today 
flaming hot. Funyuns. I'll show you the information here. If you guys want to pause that and read it. I don't know how well it's picking it up. Again, sorry about the wind. <coughs> I brought a couple bologna sandwiches. I fried up some bologna sandwiches and melted some cheese on them. And Monkey is over there. Where you at, Monk? Somewhere. There's Monkey. She's sitting on a log, eating her lunch. Well, it's way after lunchtime, but... So, and right above her head is some oranges still growing from, like I said, this used to be citrus. Uh, oranges and stuff like that. Mostly oranges, I do believe. But, anyway, again, sorry for the wind, so let's open these up. Get a thumbnail here. And let's try them. Now, I'm going to try these before I eat my sandwiches. That way, if they're really hot, it's the bread and the sandwiches should help cool down. I've got some soda. She brought some water for her and Bruno. I got a couple of these. The monkey's enjoying her sandwich. Is it me or last night I opened up a bag of these and I opened them up so I opened them upside down. I hate that. But are these getting smaller? Remember how big around they used to be and how thick they used to be? I mean, that's not a whole bunch bigger than a class ring, you know? So Let's try these. There's a boat going past. Alright, let's try these. And we'll see if they're flaming hot. Very windy. Especially to be hunting squirrels. Next month, all three weekends are for hunters. I won't be able to camp out here on the weekends that is um, but I'm guessing maybe for probably for spring turkey but okay they're not super hot guys if you ate a bunch of them I'm sure it would be but They get a two thumbs up from me. They are awesome. Now, if you if you if you can't eat spicy foods or you're not into spicy and hot things, these are not for you. They're not like super duper hot, but there is some heat here. But the flavor is tremendous. Very good. I'm glad she found them. Uh, so I'm going to break out one of my sandwiches. I brought some stuff for Bruno. He's already ate some. I fried him. I fried him up a piece of bologna and a hot dog. Chopped it all up for him. Put it in a baggie for him. So he got his water. He got him a drink and a snack. And he's standing here looking at Monkey because he knows she's got food. But uh, she walked him the whole way out here and carried our little bag for me. So I'm gonna let her sit and relax and she's looking around eating her sandwich so i'm gonna let her do that i'm gonna eat my sandwich and i'll be back with you guys here in just a minute okay guys so i just finished my sandwich and i'm still feeling the heat from them funions monkeys trying them right now and uh longer you wait the hotter it gets so yeah the hot stuff if you're not into it you're not gonna like them they are flavorful but it's kind of like a creeper. It creeps up on you and I'm still feeling it. It's not to where I can't stand it. I'm not sweating or anything yet. But they are hot. But they are very tasty, aren't they? Yeah, I like them. I yeah. could pop a bunch of them, but you saying that is a little scary. <laughs> <laughs> pop a bunch of them. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I better not. So we're going to enjoy our little picnic and I want to enjoy this here for a few minutes and uh, before we take off and um, I'll show you the oranges they're just right over here where monkey was sitting yeah about uh, 30 feet from the cabin uh, so yeah pretty nice mm -hmm. 
beautiful day. Sorry it's so windy, but I mean, you know, it is breezy. It's nice. 70 degrees. And uh, I like it out here. I can't wait to spend the night in this cabin. So I'm like Monkey will get a couple cods and yeah. we'll bring her boat tied up right down here. Mm -hmm. Huh. Yep. We'll sleep in the cabin. We'll do a what? Me. <laughs> She's jumpy. We'll do a paranormal investigation of this little cabin, maybe some of the woods. So, but anyway, yeah, those are two thumbs up for me. What do you think? Yeah, I Fla like them. Flavors are very, the flavors very good. So, I seem to handle them so far. But I'll get some more footage for you. But my main thing was for the Funyuns, the review on the Funyuns, because I've already filmed this. <coughs> um, but. If you haven't seen it, go back and check out. Uh, it's in my playlist of abandoned buildings and structures, abandoned houses and structures. Uh, so check out that playlist. A lot of good good content there. And uh, Monkey's main reason to come out here was to film the cabin since yeah. she didn't get to. So yeah, I'm gonna let, let her do all the filming she wants. And then before we take off, I'll film a little bit on the way out. Uh, not a lot because like I said my main thing was the Funyuns that she's over there tearing up right now. <laughs> Yummy! <laughs> I'll be back with you. Okay guys I thought I'd show you this orange tree. There's one orange. There's another one up behind there. There's a couple more. There's one back there. But, yeah. Hopefully you can see them. But, and there's the cabin. Looks farther than what it is, but it's about 30 feet. So that's pretty cool. They're too high up to get one, but pretty neat. Just out in the middle of nowhere. This is the log that Monkey was sitting on. Eating her lunch. She's doing her outro. So, I'll kick you guys back on here shortly. Okay, guys, we made it back to the campsite. We still got about another mile to go till we get to the truck. But uh, it's almost 4 30. It's about 4 20 right now. 4 20. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's about 4 20 right now. We were still at the cabin at 3 30, so we made good time coming back. Mm -hmm. And uh, Bruno led us the whole way. I was giving him an, an adventure, so I was like, I, I let him take lead. I still had him on the leash, but I let it come way out, and I told him, I said, come on, you got to get us the truck. We got to get mommy shelter. The snowstorm's coming in, and he just, whew, <laughs> he was pulling on me. Yeah. And uh, we come right over here, over that direction, We where we... That we came out it kind of splits and then comes back onto the trail and i said show us the truck and i knew where we were and he wanted to take the trail we went in on mm -hmm. when actually this was a little closer but i took took him in on the other trail so they could videotape so she could get some more of the trail and uh so he wanted to come back that way because he was like i don't know what's up that way but i know what's this way so he he led us the whole way. I didn't tell him which way to go, and he he brought us back. And every once in a while, he'd stop and sniff and take off some more. So he knew where we were. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Those Funyuns, awesome. I give him two thumbs up. What do you think, Monk? Yeah, I like them. Monkey, we just sat down here a few minutes ago, and Monkey was munching some more. <laughs> yeah, the problem is you can pop them in your mouth real quick, and then and then you start feeling the heat, so you got to stop. <laughs> you gotta stop yeah. <laughs> yeah. or you'll be burning yeah but they're very good two thumbs up oh yeah definitely yeah yeah they what do you think it. out of ten mm -hmm. what do you think out of ten? Oh, i give them eight eight i'm what? thinking seven yeah. yeah they need to be bigger like they used to be yeah they're small. I mean, they used to be so much bigger now they're they're not very big at all guys so anyway Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed our little uh, outing today and the review and the cabin. So, with that being said, I'm going to say Shea Bear the Myth the Man Legend. Monkey says she's out for now, y'all. <laughs> we'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good one. Take care.